Hello, it's Sarah. Something a little different today, guys. I'm doing a little reorg in my craft room. So this is my craft room. Oh, that's my... <laughs> this is what I put my camera on usually. My desk, it shoots down. This piece over there, I brought in from the master bath. And I'm going to try it in here. And I put a baker's rack in its place that I had. So remember when I did the... Um, the Zen Den tour, I showed you, I, I told you I'm going to try and use what I had. So I've been taking pieces from the rest of the house. So here I'm going to scroll over. This little other baker's rack I've had forever and it was in the basement. Right now it just has random stuff on it that I've been using in the, in the Zen Den to, you know, so there's pots on there. Anyway, um, I wanted to try it in the Zen Den, didn't like it, but for today what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace this kind of uh, shelving unit which I love I have two of three of them in here because you can hook things to them um, actually Kiwi's perch is on there so I'm gonna have to move that but I'm gonna put that white piece there because I want to go up a little higher and that just it's it's what I see every day like when I'm when I'm sitting like I'm gonna sit right now when I sit down at my desk and then I turn, that's what I see and it's very chaotic over there right now and I don't like it. Those baskets are holding um, some wood pieces that I kind of, anyway, I want to clear that up a little bit. I don't like when things are just all over the place. This is another thing I did. I turned this piece sideways. So it was facing out and it had all my scrapbook paper in it and I kept a little bit of paper down there but mostly I put wood pieces in there that I can just have at hand. Some of my um, mandala round pieces, I have stars, I have my cross that I want to do. Um, so see look, I did it a little bit of a share yesterday but like these will, oh, that one won't. That's probably a 14 inch, uh oh sorry, these will, these will fit in here. Because I can't, like, see, look, this is already, um, what are these called? These little carts that you get, the craft carts. I keep this behind me, and I've been pretty good keeping that um, with things that I'm working on in the moment. So mostly my wood for dotting and burning and all of my coloring book pages and things like that. Um, every now and then I need to go over it and re-kind of establish what I want there <clears throat> yeah it's getting a little hectic so I'm gonna go away and I'm gonna change this area I'm gonna come back when I have that white piece over there and it's all cleared up so that you can see the difference all right and I mean I could film the whole process and speed it up but I'm not gonna <laughs> because that means editing um so I'll be back when it's done and bye bye I'm back and I am so happy it looks so neat over there look nothing on the floor the basket is back beside between or whatever I did took away two those are empty those two boxes the shoe boxes and that basket is empty I'm pretty sure those are my beads that's what's holding my beads and my bracelets they're just up top for decoration right now I have no idea like I want to redo my mantle let me just take it these things were on the half wall um, the fairy houses and stuff so I'm gonna reorg that I love my topiaries but I'm not sure that they need to stay um, but yeah look at that corner now everything is off the floor I love it. I feel so much more calm. Everything is kind of chilling, okay? And I only have a little bit of mess on my desk. Not even, like this is stuff that I'm thinking I might want to put on the walls in the Zen Den. Remember those little decos I made? Um, they're just little painted pieces that I want to see if I have a place for. Um, I still haven't cleaned up from when I was painting. But this is kind of... I don't think that's going to stay. This is my macrame, so I think I'm going to put that downstairs. This basket's just really cool, and I don't know what to do with it. That basket is empty. Don't know what I'm going to do with it. So it's all pretty contained because I moved my diffuser for my um, essential oils over to here. I'm going to turn that on in a little bit. 
there's essential oils there and I put all the essential oils in this little secret cubby so I put the stool here so I moved a few plants around let me back out and show you what I did so this is my outdoor furniture that I showed you guys uh, I guess it was last summer that we got it, it might have been two summers ago now I got like um, a couch and a bunch of stuff um, nice wicker furniture that we never had we always had mix and match and when we opened up the, the the all the what am I trying to say the back deck we uncovered everything and I said I'm bringing it in the house and I'm gonna see what it feels like in here so I put that picture on the wall because I think it really has a vibe that kind of might be happy in here and the way the table is right now everything looks good um, I moved that bird the big bird of paradise I don't know actually that might have been up there but I've just been moving things around little by little um, that's not a bird of paradise that's the uh, the other one peace lily anyway so this is pretty much the same although no it's not because I went and got another table I don't even know if you can see this stuff but anyway and then on the other side of the room is the other chair with an ottoman so it feels pretty done like I'm not gonna I still go and look at Marshall's and TJ Maxx and all that but I haven't bought anything because I am using what I have there was such a cute planter at home goods yesterday but it was like 30 bucks and it was it was so cute though but I thought I'm using my stools that I've painted, all that stuff. Like I moved that in here and it, where Ginny's laying, there's another planter thing right there that I put two plants on. And then I brought this up from the basement because I wanted to see what it felt like. And I think it's staying there for right now. Like it's on the other side of the French doors, which I really don't use. I only use this one side because my rolly cart is on the other side of it. So it kind of disguises that a little bit. And I was thinking of putting all the plants that like to be misted, the humidity loving plants on there, because I could just mist the heck out of that. And I don't really care. Like that is old. I've had that forever. Um, so yeah, I think now this will change. Obviously I'm not going to be able to like right now the, um, my little basket rack thing is back there. Cause I just have random things hanging on it. I don't know that this right here, this section is going to be able to fit once the real couch comes because I think the real couch, like that table, is going to be moved all the way to the wall. I'm pretty sure. Now, that being said, the thing is not coming in stock, so I might get something else. I really, really loved it, and I that's kind of what I've designed this whole room around. So, like, I don't know if that bird or that peace lily would be able to fit there when the new couch comes. You know, so I'm going to have to figure stuff out. I could maybe pull it forward and that way there could be stuff behind it. But I haven't really thought that through fully. Um, but yeah, because the, the chase will come out to like here. I measured it. So the chase is going to be like, you know, so anywho, as for right now, though, everything's going really well. Um, I definitely moved a few things around because I didn't have those two tables, but I had too many plants. I changed the whole, look, I got that big wandering Jew. It's like all the different kinds. So there's purple ones and there's um, variegated ones and they're all flowering. Some of them, it might need a drink. Sorry, I'm distracted. I look at them. But yeah, I changed, I put my peperomias on the wall. Um, so I just changed that around a little bit and I like it like I think it's staying like that um, I just got this one. This is actually a coleus. It's for outdoors, but I got it and I'm keeping it in here for now Just to see what it what it thinks about being in here, but I couldn't resist the pink It was so pretty so that See, there's the other table. That stuff on there is just going upstairs. That's all my, like, Al-Anon stuff. I just got, like, a shipment of books that I, because I'm literature. But, um, so that just all has to go upstairs. So I don't know where that rack is going to go. That, um, because they're awesome. I've had them in my craft room, so I'll just scan around. Nothing's changed over there. But, yeah, I kind of like that there. Um, I'm not hating it, you know. 
um, like I said, because right now it's just holding my empty pots, just random things, and I keep moving my my prayer plant because I just don't know. I just read that he likes uh, away from the window, and he was right under the window, so I'm keeping him over here now. And that's it, just kind of like empty, fill in the space type stuff. I moved stuff. I had plants on that bottom shelf, but now it's just my plant books, and my rock book. That plate was in my kitchen for years, but I like to pull the burgundy over. So I do like having the burgundy as my accent color. And I do like that picture up there. Like if you look at it from a distance, I think it looks fine. And I'm gonna end up filling, like I think I'm gonna put my moth up there. Like I might put my moth, I'm gonna put a bunch of little stuff around I think too. Like I might add another cross, like a wood burn cross, so we'll see. But for right now, um, pretty much done. I'm not gonna do much, many other big things. Uh, oh, I just hung my, look, this is my little gardening angel. She was in my craft room forever, but she goes in here. And uh, everything else is the same. Um, pretty sure, I think I moved this down from the um, half wall. It's kind of wonky, but. I moved it down from the half wall. I just liked it. And I put the um, kukui nut um, lays that we got from Hawaii on that. Um, but yeah, everything else pretty much left the same. And that's it, you guys. I'm pretty happy. Yeah, like even this outdoor furniture. I mean, I don't care. It's not like uncomfortable. I mean, it's fine. It's not... You know, I mean, we sit on it outside, so it's just not meant to be inside, but for right now, it's working, and I'm very happy that it's not, like, mix and match furniture in here, but after, like, the pool opens, I'll probably have to put it outside, but for right now, I'm going to come back into my craft room. Sorry, there's the doggie, but yeah, I kind of like that. Let me know in the comments if you think the wicker shelving stays there. I think it's fine. And I could like hang a plant from the top, like I think it's good. And then you come in my craft room, it's so neat, except for the desk. But everything is, oops, crash, so neat. I'm gonna sit down and just kind of pan around. And so you see how neat it is, OMG. Yeah, so it's not, like I have so much more room now. I have, cause the bottom is filled. I think this is, I don't even know what I put down here, but look. Look how much stuff fits down there. I think this is all beads. These are empty. I think it's bead stuff. There's an empty thingy right here. Um, so yeah, so that's awesome. And I don't think, oh wait, let's see. I have some ribbon here and I haven't even filled the drawer. So, and then like I said, oh, this is not empty. This is uh, this is for when I make my mandalas on, from the Glowforge. So I just put that in there and these are definitely empty. And this is just for my bracelets. This is my beads, all my beads and my bracelets. But yeah, so, and then that birdhouse, I have no idea what to do with it. So anyway, and like, like I said, the mantle, I don't think it's staying like that. But for right now, I'm backing up. Beep, beep. <laughs> It just looks so much neater. I'm so happy I did that. So listen, don't be afraid to try something new. Just because you've been living with something the way it, way it is for a long time doesn't mean you can't change it. Like that little lamp there, that was in the Zen Den. I'm taking it back upstairs. I'll put it in my bathroom. Um, yeah, like that basket's empty. Those That will probably go in the basement. And I'll just put, be able to put, I don't know, decorative stuff up there, like things I've painted or something. All right, you guys, so that's it. Thanks for watching.